very good morning so now we have finished our basic uh, first uh, three topics i have finished and two topics uh, are covering professor torni sir right so one part is uh, remain here so for our study this year the uh, study of plant families are there so we are studying the plant families with reference to the systematic position silent features then floral formula floral diagram and the any five examples with their economic importance so these eight families are there out of which four families we have covered in the practical so from these eight family so one number anonesi family second meliesi third mirtesi fourth rubiesi fifth solanesi sixth apocynesi seventh euphorbiesi and the eighth amaryllidesi right so we will see the one by one about the characteristics of this family so first family anonesi is there i think you are knowing this example or you have identified it is the custard apple in marathi it is called as the sita apple so i have selected this photograph of plant then entire fruit and the ls of the fruit is there right uh, remember the botanical name anona squamosa right so correct botanical name it carries the one mark or either you have to uh, mcq type questions or if offline you have to write it properly then the systematic position is classification so how it is classified so firstly division phanerogams that is flowering plants right subdivision angiosperm sperms that is ovules are enclosed in the ovary uh, then class dicotyledons reticulate venation and the seeds with two cotyledons in theory you have to write minimum one character then subclass polypetali that is petals are free series thalami flori that is stamens are hypogynous hypogynous means what all floral parts stamens develop below the ovary and then on the thalamus and the order ranales indefinite stamens many stamens are there how indefinite we will see in the diagram then apocarpus gynoecium apo means what free free carpels Gy uh, carpel that is gynoecium or the fused are there we are calling as the syncarpus then family anonesi the trimerous flower so petals are a three plus three or the perianth is there uh, tepals three plus three or the if petals they are three plus three then stamens with enlarged connective how it is enlarged we will see the in diagram and the aggregate fruit so above fruit type we have seen the aggregate type of the fruit right then uh, uh, these are the diagrams for the family anonesi so so this is the flower uh, line drawings are there you are observing the branch the flower is developing in the axillary position the leaf is there it is simple leaf uh, then it shows the reticulate venation then you are observing the flower with sepals petals stamens pistil or the reduced uh, uh, petals are there you see the thalamus above c diagram and the a diagram branch is there b is for the flower right then c is for the ls of the flower uh, then uh, d diagram is there you are observing it is for the flower dissected in the d uh, diagram uh, lower part so carpels on the receptacle then stamens on the receptacle right stalk of flower is there pedicel and the calyx so you observe this uh, diagram properly so this is very nice uh, uh, line drawing then fruit it is having the aggregate that is all uh, carpels are united in rind formation upon patu sita poila shizad salaste kadeni right so this uh, character is for the aggregate fruits then uh, g diagram it is for the stamens are there uh, in this one above you see so anther lobes are there filament is very thick uh, right anther uh, lobes they are showing the 
uh, thick and the e, uh, e diagram it is for the ts of ori so it shows the uh, diagram for the ts of ori that is the it shows the entire this uh, fruit so fruit is there and the floral diagram in floral diagram uh, for this year already we have seen in the practical so you have to show the position of the uh, sepals or the perianth or the petals are there and the number of stamens and ts of ori so how are the silent feature we will see the one by one so these are the silent feature habit aromatic shrub or climbers the good example of this family is artea botrys here what's up right or the uh, some uh, mostly it is a shrub then some are the climbers then tree species are the anona squamosa and reticulata right ramphal and sitapur polyalthia longifolia minimum you remember no one name of genus polyalthia manje apan tela ka manto longifolia ashoka se jar there are the wild ducts present therefore the specific aroma is there stem is woody erect branch or the climbing already in morphology we have seen the character but just here you have to mention this character then leaves alternate petiolate simple entire stipule is absent so ex stipulate diastipus uh, generally it shows the uh, there is having the reticulate finition and the gland dotted typical odor is there right i think you uh, uh, enjoy the odor of this leaves of the uh, sitaphal and the ramphal then inflorescence so it is generally cymos because the usually flowers are single in pairs in artrebotis or this example we are observing the anona right so good example others are the cauliflowers call in cauliflower uh, we are knowing flowers on the older uh, on the old wood portion is there so there it is in the bunch then these flowers are large bisexual hypogynous then trimerous trimerous that is 3m 3 plus 3 six uh, cal calyx are there so 3 to 6 Uh, then uh, uh, petals are uh, suppose six, so they are fleshy in the two series, three plus three, right? So hollowed type of the estuation. Then to this flower, there, there is a bract in the polyalthia and the anona. Sita polani rampol, that is called the bract as the. Then corolla, calyx corolla are there, uh, their shape and the, they are persistent. They are persistent, that is the remains up to fruit formation. and arrangement estivation valvet that is just a touch so already you are knowing uh, how are the these uh, arrangements or the types of estivation are there right so you remember this very nicely then gynoecium is there carpels are many apocarpus uh, that is many carpels are there uh, then uh, they uh, they closely packed to the stamens spirally arranged on the receptacle raised receptacle i think we have seen this diagram right again i will show this the diagram you see this diagram d right so in the d diagram the position of uh, carpels on the receptacle below this stamens are there so there is a raised receptacle is there so this is uh, these are the some silent feature then about the fruit is there so how is the fruit so it is the eterea of berry or fleshy berry type right many ovaries are joined together and therefore the thalamus form a fleshy mass uh, which uh, protect the ingrowth uh, and therefore pericarp is developed right sitapal pato apan tyacha kadani ashi gol green colored uh, this particular fruit is there so first uh, photograph uh, already we have seen so in uh, and family anonesi fruits are aggregate so therefore eterio of Uh, berries berries means they are the uh, citrus or all these fruits these are the berries type right so you just uh, see um, about this uh, character and remember the proper meaning of this one so here the aggregate fruits these are simple each one is called as a fruitlet right and therefore the, as the fruit contains many aggregated simple individual berries अपन पहतो एट द ईटिंग टाइम 
so many seeds are there in the this one and each seed along with one fruitlet is there and around this whatever we edible part it is the endosperm we are eating the endosperm so all these characters you have to remember properly then how to write the floral formula already we have seen in the practical but again here if bract is present we are writing br or if absent ebr e bracteate then actinomorphic then bisexual male and female together then there are the calyx 2 or 3 right corolla 3 or 3 plus 3 and androsium they are the many right here the sign of many is there and carganosium are many free so there is no bracket if uh, number two is there so there is the bracket is there so here bracket is not there so just you have to remember all these uh, characters of the family then main distinguishing characters what are family so plants are trees or climbers or shrubs aromatic then leaves are entire gland dotted uh, it is very distinguishing character so remember this character then these are the some good examples are there just uh, we have seen anona reticulata right so it is the rumpled then artabortis odoratissimus remember the name hirwa safa right then uh, lower one is the same uh, anona uh, reticulata is there right so you have to remember uh, this uh, character again so here uh, we have to see about these uh, characters are there so here then polyalthia longifolia see the good photograph of this ashok tree month of polyalthia longifolia then uh, uh, here we are knowing Okay.
okay so you see this is the uh, polyalthia longipolia then canagia odorata it is the one uh, like the uh, this uh, green uh, sofa so here you are observing then uh, the common other these examples their character so we have to give the these uh, names anonas camosa it is a fruit tree used as an insecticide leaves are used anona reticulata ramphol it is cultivated in uh, uh, cultivated with large brown red highly fleshy fruit and the it leaves are seed oil it is used as insecticide or the soap making artabotrys odoratissimus hirva safa so it is large scented shrub and uh, yellow fragrant flowers are there it gives essential oil for the making perfumes and polyalthia longifolia ashok so plant is a large tree drooping branches and beautiful green foliage and used as a avenue trees in the gardens and wood is used as a timber and uh, canaja odorata it is uh, obtaining in the china uh, uh, macascar oil it is obtained from this one so this is our today's family in the next lecture we will see the family uh, two family meliesi okay so thanks to all